Okay, so what we're going to go through here is a interval in the aerobic system on the treadmill. So we already know how to use the treadmill at this stage, so if you can just pop the clip on for me, Sam. And I want you to go into a light walk as a 5 out of 7. Sorry, 5 out of 10. Still using the RPE scale, just starting off at this light intensity of a light to a brisk walk. We're going to work here with a ratio of 1 to 1, essentially meaning that it's equal parts so that we have one minute at an intensity of a 5 and one minute an intensity of a 7. And we'll do that five times to make 10 minutes. Okay. So, when you get to the one minute mark, we're going to go to a seven, which is going to be, looking what I can see, a light to a moderate job. Still working in the aerobic zone, you're still going to be able to breathe with this one, and we're still going to be able to have a conversation. Okay, so 10 more seconds. Set that it does it for you, you don't have to mess around. You can do that if you want, but what we're really looking for is can you deliver it and get the engagement. Okay, so what we're really doing here is trying to work on your aerobic system as the name suggests. So with this, we are getting more option around the body, building this baseline of aerobic fitness, and it's also a little bit more stimulating than just going for a long, straight, continuous run because that can be quite minor to a lot of people. Yeah? Okay, so you start to bring that back up. It's not only just mind numbing for a lot of people, it also isn't very transferable into other things. So this is a little bit more realistic for somebody who is just starting out training and can't do 10 minutes on a treadmill at a straight intensity, for example. So they can't run for 10 minutes, they can do a bit of running and a bit of walking. And it's really nice because you can use the system on anything, just about. So, cross trainer, stepper, rower, treadmill, bike, spin bike, hand bike, whatever it may be, you can use the system quite well. Nice. Okay, so three more seconds and we're going to bring it back. Yeah. Work. So how are you finding this compared to the normal running that we've previously been doing where we've just been doing straight lines? Uh, yeah, it's a bit more manageable, a bit more uh, enjoyable. <laughs> That's monotonous. Yeah, it's good. 
Yeah. Breaks up a little bit. Yeah. Yeah. Still able to talk all the way through. If at any point you feel like you can't talk, just let me know because the, the intensity is therefore too high. Yeah. So aerobic intervals, great for burning calories, but a lower level for people who aren't as fit as that aren't fit enough to do higher intensity, releases endorphins to make you feel better, but also good for building a baseline for sport in everyday life where you can transfer that over or build upon it when you go to do that later. Okay, so we'll do one more first to this. Stays in the centre of the belt, so we still want to be monitoring our clients all the way through. Good. Okay, so what I also do here is use a bit more of a talk test. So tell me how you found um, cardio in the last few weeks. Like, how's it been for you? Because I know it's something you weren't doing too much until we started adding it in. Yeah, so it's tough at the beginning, but once you get into it, it's actually quite enjoyable. You can feel the difference quite quickly. Yeah, but it's definitely something you can uh, carry on to, to everyday life, which is good. Yeah. How have you been feeling in terms of yourself, your energy, and that sort of thing? Yeah, it's slightly more energetic, and I just feel a little bit more prepared when it comes to exercise and looking quicker and walking everywhere and uh, yeah, just a little bit more comfortable with things I wasn't as comfortable as before. Good. Yeah, so once you get good at this, we can start to increase the intensity later when we start to put on like or go into the muscle building phase of things where we can make it more higher intensity. Yeah. But we need this decent baseline fitness first before we can go into that. Just so your body and your nervous system which you used to the training demands because you can't go from zero to hero because that never ends well, you're gonna in, get injured and burnt out and, and so on. So okay, so let's bring that one to a stop. Okay, so we cut it there at seven minutes. Again, it depends on what you've written in your program on your pro and card. You might do it for 10, you might do it for 8, you might do it for 12, whatever it is. Your tutor or your assessor will go through that with you. We just used an, uh, what, how long did we do? Eight minutes? Eight minutes. Eight minutes example of what an aerobic one-to-one -one ratio would look like on a treadmill.